an increased threat of terrorist attacks and unauthorized explosions, as well as the growing use of underground space, a typical feature of urbanization, highlights the importance of ensuring a high level of safety in underground structures. Consequently, the mitigation of explosion effects in tunnels, subways, coal mines, and other underground facilities is very important. The Mining Institute of Georgia in Tbilisi and the Center for Infrastructure Protection and Physical Security at the University of Florida designed an automatic system for the protection of peoples and facilities from internal explosions called Parda 2011 or Curtain 2011. This protective system consists of wireless devices for explosion detection and a blast energy absorber for shockwave suppression. The wireless detection devices contain the transmitter and receiver modules. The transmitter module contains a sensor, a microprocessor, equipped with blast detection software, and a transceiver that serves to transmit an encoded signal. The receiver module, installed in a blast absorber control unit, produces an initiation signal to activate the absorber. The absorber is composed of a control unit, a main water container, two side water containers, and nozzles. At the command of the initiation signal, the absorber produces tailored dispersing water mist barriers along selected sections of a tunnel. Absorbers are installed at a regular distance from each other along the protected underground facility. The distance between neighboring absorbers is optimized according to the specific site and the anticipated blast conditions. The optimized wireless detection and activation system will ensure that the absorber can respond in time to protect the designated underground zones. Upon initiation, the absorber discharges highly pressurized water mist, thus creating a blast energy attenuating barrier that shields people and facilities from the blast wave. In an unprotected tunnel, the blast wave can spread several hundred meters along the tunnel, which poses serious hazards to people and to mechanical systems. In a protected tunnel, a blast wave cannot spread past the point where the blast absorbing barrier has been created by an absorber. People and equipment behind the protective barrier remain unharmed. The protective system can be designed for tunnels with different sized cross sections by adjusting the number and or size of the blast energy absorbers. For the protection of tunnels with small cross sections, the installation of a single protective device at optimal distances on one side might be sufficient. Tunnels with larger cross sections might require several devices placed at optimal distances opposite each other, with optional devices installed on the ceiling. The presented protection system can be effectively applied in motorway and railway tunnels, subway tunnels, coal mines under threat of methane explosions, land or sea-based oil platforms, other petrochemical plants, long superstructures with limited cross sections that could fill with gas or dust explosions. Remember, human life is priceless.